Hey there, YouTubers. Uh, thanks for joining me today. I'm, I'm talking to you today about a Dell computer that I just finished up. Uh, and I'm going to give you the general symptoms real quick and the solution real quick. I don't want to tie you up with all the things I had to do to resolve it. But one, when you start the computer, and this doesn't have to be just a Dell. This can be any computer. If you start the computer and it doesn't load into the operating system, it seems to hang on the splash screen. But if you hit a key, any key, and it boots into the operating system, and then when you get into the operating system, you cannot type. This is what you're going to do temporarily to get it fixed. I'm going to tell you right now, it's, it's a broken keyboard. Um, but there might just be one single key. In my case, it was the control key. And how I found that out is I was able to finally force the computer into um, an external DOS command. And I went to type and it had the caret key. But that, that's irrelevant. If you're having those symptoms where you start the, the computer and you have to strike a key or um, you can't type when you get in there, when you get into the logon screen, basically... If you have to, you're going to have to go back to here. You're going to have to sign out. Or if you have a password, you're going to go right to the login screen. You're going to um, automatically, you're going to click on this symbol right here. And this is going to pop up. You're going to swipe, you're going to swipe the filter key on and then back off. And then go ahead and try to log into your operating system. Um, you may, it may work for you. It may not. Um, basically what we're doing is uh, turning the key the keyboard uh, the filter keys it, for some reason the operating system thinks the filter keys are on because if you turn filter keys on so um, uh, basically you, let me just show you real quick um, what happens if the filter keys are on okay so if you open up the control panel and you go into ease of access um, you should be able to go down to keyboard adjustments and um, right here you'll see turn on filter keys well it doesn't work from here that's the problem I've tried turning filter keys hitting apply but let's let's say the filter keys are on well this is what you're going to get you'll get a bunch of clicking or a noise so that's another sign that this will work for you. So if you turn it back on or turn it back off, um, I should be, go over, be able to go in here and type. So uh, hopefully this helps someone. So basically what it is is you, you've got a broken keyboard. So you're going to have to take your keyboard out. And you can also use an external keyboard. Some, some of you are going to have to completely disconnect the one keyboard or go into device manager and um, uninstall the actual keyboard before the other keyboard will work but um, give it a shot just uh, as you log in just before you log in swipe this on swipe the filter key off and then you should be good to go all right hope this helps someone thanks for watching